Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be going over the structure and function of a choanocyte. Choanocytes are specialized cells found in members of the order Periphera, commonly known as the sponges. Choanocytes, which are also called collar cells or gastral cells, consist of a large round or oval cell. This oval cell has a large single nucleus and a long flagella that extends out one side of the cell body. This flagella is surrounded by what is called the collar. The collar is made up of around 20 to 55 microvilli that are connected to neighboring microvilli by mucous strands. The flagella beats which causes water to move into the collar. The collar functions in filtering out food particles. Food particles at the base of the collar are ingested by the cell through the process of phagocytosis. Inside the cell, the food particle is found within a food vacuole. The cell often has lots of these food vacuoles at one time. Choanocyte cells line the inside layer in the structure of a sponge. Sponges also have cells called ostea, singular ostium, that form pores in the sponge. Inside the sponge is an area known as the spongocele. The sponge also has a large opening called the osculum. The movement of the flagella of the choanocyte simultaneously causes the movement of water through the sponge. The water comes in through the osteopores, past the choanocytes where nutrients and food can be collected, then into the spongocele and up out of the sponge through the osculum. Choanocytes can also differentiate to form the spermatozoa. The spermatozoa are also known as the sperm or male gamete and are used during sexual reproduction in sponges. After differentiating, they will move from the internal surface of the sponge and leave the sponge with the flow of water out of the osculum. And that concludes this video on the structure and function of a choanocyte. Thank you for watching. If you want to support this channel, please subscribe and check out more of my videos.